Hey guys, Juju22 here, and welcome back to the Mii Fighter Rumble. This show is brought to you by MuchGames.ca, Slack Slouch Gaming, Gamecast, uh, Dem Boys, uh, McRumps, uh, who else? The the Gaming Beatdown, uh, Sons of Kojima, uh, and the Yoshi Clan. Uh, those are just some of the affiliations that... I'm either loosely affiliated with, uh, whether it's through association or if I'm actually a, an official member of each of them. But, but uh, nonetheless, though, uh, those are just the sponsors. So I just wanted to get that out of the way. Anyway, uh, welcome back. And uh, last time uh, we lost Jacoy, who was in there the second longest. But the guy that's been in there the longest so far is. Sephiroth 1204 he's just proving to be he's just proving why he is named after the one winged angel but we'll see if he can fly all the way to the finals and maybe even become the Mii Fighter champion but of course he cannot overlook any of his opponents if he wishes just to survive along with uh, the squid boy or it says Nino, but it's supposed to be Nino, uh, Spanish for um, Squid Boy. But yeah, Squid Boy, he won the last round, and before that it was Oscar, or or Os Oscar actually won uh, two rounds before that, I should say, excuse me. But Oscar, he's been in there the second longest at this time, as well as my good friend Val, Valerie, Blue Bab 23 whatever you want to call her, but Blue Bab 23 or Val, uh, she she managed to survive for one round, but let's see if she can go all the way. As we meet our four new contestants, let's start with this guy right here. Pink Pollo, very good friend of mine, and he is one-third of the trio's champions, along with Chikoy, who was eliminated in the previous round, and Tamman C, who was uh, in the Rumble very early in the Rumble, but didn't last very long. Well, let's see if Pink Pollo has what it takes to be Pollomon, as he calls himself. But then we also have Lario. Uh, Lario plays uh, the blue Yoshi, the dark blue Yoshi of the Yoshi clan. We'll see how he does in his run. I mean, Pack Dude, so far Pack Dude has done a pretty good job. I mean, Pack Dude was in there for like, what, four, three, four rounds? Won one of them? But we'll see how Lario does, and we'll see if he can even make it to the finals. But, of course, we cannot overlook the Dark Horse. Retro Rick XTN. My best friend of over six years, uh, now going on seven. I have to say, Rick is just a very good friend of mine, and... I mean, we've been friends for very long, even before I got my own uh, YouTube channel. I, I have nothing but respect with, with with for Rick, and, you know, he just does his own thing, and I respect him for that. I respect him a lot for that, and and also, I believe Lario has over 200 subscribers. Uh, I know he's been in uh, on YouTube for two years now, and... Uh, I wish him the best, and I definitely wish Rick the best, and Pink Poyo, I wish you a whole lot of success, as I would this guy right here. This guy is definitely like my brother from another mother, because, you know, I, I, I look at him as my brother, you know, because, you know, maybe a, a little brother, yeah, but, but he's my brother. Of course, he doesn't act like a little brother, but, but, you know, I, I like. Jason RPG. He's he's like a brother to me. But I've been friends with him for give or take at least four, going on four years now. Uh, so I've known uh, Jason for a while. And I mean, I don't know everything about him. I mean, I know more than the average person does, but even then, I, I've known of him for quite a while. And I just want to say I'm happy that I was able to inspire him to get back into playing uh, Final Fantasy VII, which he's doing a Let's Play of. Uh, I'm not sure if he's finished it by this point, uh, as of the time that this is being posted. But as of the time that this is being recorded, yeah, he's still going strong on that one. 
but uh, but anyway, I want to wish all these guys luck and and lady. Can't forget the beautiful lady. Of course, she's already taken, fellas. So re just relax. And then of course we have my cat Oscar. But we'll find out who is moving on, and unfortunately, who's going to be left behind. We'll find out right now. There we go. So we have uh, four sword fighters, two brawlers, and two gunners. So the sword fighter is definitely going to have some sort of an advantage. But then again, it's every man and woman for themselves. And oh, I almost forgot to mention Oscar is, a, is definitely a dude. Anyway, uh, match underway. I mean, I really... Oh, wow. Just like that, Rick already falls down, and... That's the thing about Rick, is that his his recovery is not that good. I might have to uh, change that up, uh, probably after this tournament. Uh, whether he wins or loses. Um, and now, Pink Poyo got himself that, uh, that checkpoint flag. And if you use it, and it gets used up, then uh, it depends on the mode. If you're playing a survival mode where you're using stocks and if you use it and use it all the way, uh, you get an extra life. Uh, but it, but in this match, but in a time match, uh, you get one point scot free. So Pink Poyo just got himself a point scot free, and it didn't hurt anybody. It just helped him. But that could be the wild card in this. We'll see if Pink Poyo advances just because of that. Oh, and that was an explosive crate on uh, Val. I mean, of course, if any one person could dominate this match, it has to be Jason RPG. I mean, his track record alone, you know, his track record alone is just that amazing, really. But of course, Sephiroth has proven to be the Iron Man for a reason. Got about less than two minutes left to go, and Val just failed to her death and loses a point to Lario. And Oscar has that uh, has that I forgot the name of that uh, that thing, but it go it, it, once it hits ground, it, it it just moves in a clockwise direction until it runs out. Like it doesn't instantly kill you, but if you're at high enough damage, it will. Uh, now you have that boy that turns into animals and can beat people up. to turn into a snake and is beating up Oscar as well as uh, the squid boy and now he's beating up uh... oh wow a lot of uh, deaths and uh, a lot of points scored who's gonna get that ball who got it oh it Val got it and she knocked out at the very least uh, pink Poyo. Wow, Oscar and Jason RPG just scored a lot of points right there on that little exchange. And Sephiroth scored one on uh, Lario. And how apropos, I mean, Val had, well, she had in her possession uh, the Star Rod. I mean, in part because, well, she's the blue, cor the blue Kirby, I should say, excuse me. She's the blue Kirby. Even though Pink Poyo is supposed to be, you know, Kirby himself. We're almost at the end here. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, who won? The winner is once again the Squid Boy. So the Squid Boy has dominated for the last, for two matches in a row. 
let's see the margin of victory. I, I want to see this. So, so you, well, actually, it wasn't really that much of a dominant victory. It was just, it was close, but, but by that much, the Squid Boy has advanced. Also advancing is my cat, Oscar. Jason RPG is also advancing. And then we have a three-way tie for fourth, which is good enough for all three of them to advance. So, in fourth, we have Val, also moving on, as well as Pink Poyo, also moving on, and my best friend, Rick, also moving on. But unfortunately, the two people that just missed it, Lario Plays, is gone. But more so than that, the Iron Man. Sephiroth1204 has finally been defeated. So that's it for Lario, and that's it for... Uh, I mean, Lario was one and done, so I actually didn't think he was going to continue on. But then again, you know, these things could have... It could have just as... He could have just as easily made it as he could have been eliminated, and he's eliminated. But for Sephiroth, he was in there for the longest time, and he has finally been defeated. So Sephiroth is gone, which now leaves Oscar as the guy that has been in there the longest. And Squid Boy's not that far off, either. But that's it for this one. Uh, so only two people got eliminated. So we'll meet two new people, and we'll be right back after this. Thank you. 